Hello, lovely people, my fellow diamond painters. I'm so excited to share with you Satra um, with, from Diamond Art Club and by Margaret Morales. Um, I am going to unbox this tonight and it's like midnight, so bear with me. Um, I sound raspy because I'm still recovering from strep. <clears throat> so I will sound better <laughs> later when I am feeling better. Um, but I am Courtney Lyons with uh, Diamonds Are a Girl's Best Friend, and come along with me as we unbox this kit. I'm so excited. All right, here we are. So, like I said, this is uh, Margaret Morales. Let's see, make sure it focuses. Um, called Satra. I keep calling it Sakura. I'm sorry, it's Satra. But Margaret Morales, it's square. It is 22 inches by 34 inches, so 55.8 centimeters by 86 centimeters on top. Um, yes, oh my gosh. When I first saw this kit on Cyber Monday as a sneak peek, I believe either Rachel Ray or Emeralds and Fairy Lights. I'm not sure, I'm not entirely sure who it was that unboxed this one. Um, gosh, I, you know, uh, it was, uh, Diamonds and Washi, <clears throat> who did the one of the other Margaret Morales's. It was the the blue one with the dragon. I'm not good at remembering these. So <clears throat> anyway, yes, I just I love Margaret Morales anyway, and I've seen her work on I know like a lot of post reviews of D DIY Moon Shop or Diamond Moon Shop, and sadly they're out of business. Um, so I was so excited to see that Diamond Art Club picked her up. It's amazing. All right, one moment. I'm going to go grab a drink. All right, sorry about that. I am actually going to sing on Saturday at my church uh, Christmas party. So we're going to see how that works. Hopefully my voice comes back because tomorrow's Wednesday and it's not even any better yet. Um, so I only have a few more days to get my voice back or it's going to be rough. All right, so yeah, let's, let's get this started. So here is, um, it comes with a toolkit. Um, which we'll, I will open and we'll look through. I'm really excited to see what the cover binder is, stuff is. Um, Diamond Art Club is actually, they're going to start phasing out their toolkit, uh, or sorry, not the toolkit, the um, cover binder, which I'm sad about. Our, my kids absolutely love those too. Um, but you know, there's plenty of other places to grab them. Um, and then here is the, um, it's like a sticker. Uh, you can put it in a logbook. Um, some people will put it on the, um, I suppose right here on the end of their boxes. So if they store them in the boxes, they can uh, easily find them when they're just stacked like this. I actually, <laughs> maybe this is an unpopular opinion, especially for people who like will commonly de-stash, but I don't actually um, keep them in the boxes. Maybe I'll do a video one day of how I store my diamond painting. It's very, um, it's not like the best setup yet, but it's getting better. So yes, this is the sticker. A lot of times people put that on it. Um, beautiful. Gosh, look at that. Let me like even just the thumbnail. I'm so excited, guys. I have not opened this yet. I have not. Um, I'm not even seen it yet. So you will see my raw reaction. I'm so excited. All right, so here's the toolkit. Okay. Let's open this up. I suppose you actually don't even have to do that. I keep forgetting. That. All right, so it comes with it is square, so it will come with um, some tweezers. Ooh, focus. Um, it will come with some tweezers. It won't focus on the tweezers. There we go. And it comes with very sharp, so um, I just can't get it to focus on the tweezers. Let's see what we can do. Focus. All right, one second. There we go, tweezers. Okay, so yeah, they're very sharp, so they actually come with these these caps. Um, because, ooh, those are sharp. Actually, funny story. My son had them, and uh, he just happened to have them in his hands, because they died in paint with me. Threw it across the kitchen, for no reason whatsoever. I, I have no idea what was going through his head. And um, they stuck right into the vinyl flooring of this very old house, and I was like, Dude, if your brother was right there, because we've got a little baby about a year old, or your sister, um, it would have been the end of you, buddy. <laughs> Just 
All right, so it usually comes with a, a diamond painting pen. This one is like a beautiful purple. Whoa, struggling to focus. There we go. Oh, I haven't seen that before. That's gorgeous. They're always sparkly. Um, it comes with some bags. You can't ever have enough bags. I noticed there's never enough in there like to kit up in bags um, for your kits, but um, you know, they're great for overflow or I'm sure for leftovers. Um, yeah, use them for a lot. So use them probably for some of my cheaper kits too that I got from uh, from Timu AliExpress that I can't show on these channels because I bought them before I learned about um, legally licensing. And so I will no longer be buying those and I will not be showing them on the channel, but I will do them. Uh, we will finish them, my kids and I, because you know, there's no point in wasting. So that is beautiful washi tape. It always comes with washi tape. Um, wow, that's gorgeous. That might actually like work really well with this. Um, it's random, so. And then here's the cover minder. Ooh, not my favorite green, um, but I bet my kids would like this one. Um, comes with a, uh, a squishy for your pen. If your hands don't get pretty and tired. I usually, I have a Diamond Art Club pen that I use, so I probably won't use these, but here's like a, like this is what, like a seven placer is what it says, and then a um, four placer. I'm really excited, I'm, next purchase I'm going to make, my goodness, we're struggling to focus. Next purchase that I'm going to make with Diamond Art Club, um, which won't be for a while, probably around my daughter's birthday in February, um, I will uh, be getting the four placer metal tip um of the stainless steel and probably the single placer four placer is my go-to i absolutely love four placers i try bigger and i probably just not good at it yet. i'm so new to this anyway it comes with these heart waxes um also not my favorite wax i have yet to find something i like really because wax is like the bane of my existence right now i have not found something that i really like but i keep hearing about patty wax um you know, I think I will try it and do a review for you guys someday. Um, some, some one of these times I will because I'm really excited. I think it's cool that it's scented too. All right, so here is the tray that it comes with. I love the idea of the stopper. I used it quite a bit. I don't like the size of the tray as much. I'd rather a larger tray, but that doesn't matter. It's I'll still use it. My kids will use it, and I'll use like the larger tray. The stopper just doesn't fit with the larger tray. Um, but anyway, yeah, that is the. Um, the toolkit, I mean, it's an amazing toolkit. Those tweezers, we have a lot of these tweezers right now, and they're so useful for so much. I actually dug out a sliver out of my son's foot with them. <laughs> they worked so well. So, very useful for other things too. All right, ooh, let's get into this. Okay, let's just roll this out. I don't know that my setup will very easily show this whole canvas. All right, wait, before we do that, let's look at the, um, so it comes with the, it's kind of like a, um, a thank you. Whoop, let's get that in the right spot. Uh, like a thank you note um, from uh, the founder of them in our club. It tells you what's included, um, tips and tricks. I know that you can go on and find um, a video on, Diamonds and Washi, um, I believe Rachel Ray has one, um, Emeralds and Fairy Lights, I believe that My Happy Place, another diamond painter YouTube, has um, a how-to video, I think most people do, I'll probably have to do one too, I think. Um, anyway, and it has step-by-step -step instructions and a video instruction, but you know, it's kind of fun to go on and see the videos that those ladies have put up. They, went into a lot of trouble and go into a lot of detail and give you a lot of um, recommendations for products and stuff too. So yeah, that's a, there's got a thank you 10. I'm so glad I've never actually paid full price yet. I'm kind of a coupon finder, so, um, but they're actually better ones than that usually. So if it's your first time, um, I know there's like a, quite a few of the YouTubers that have like a 20% off a coupon code if you just go down to the bottom of their videos. And this one is if you're the first time you're doing that it's like this is your first time purchase on an app so you can even get the 20% off if you do it on like a computer 
or just like a browser and then you can get another 20% on another uh, purchase on just the app. So that's a really good deal. Um, ooh, there's enough colors in here to have two sheets. Oh, look at the stickers. Look how beautiful that is. I actually from Amazon just ordered um, a diamond painting journal or I guess logbook is what you would call it. So I'm really excited for that. So this is 71 colors. Oh, that's the most, that would be the most that I've done so far. Anyway, so we've got, it looks like one, two, three, eight, no, two ABs. Two ABs because anything under 150 is going to be an AB. And then K444, which I believe is the iridescent or the, shoot, I think it's the iridescent. I could be wrong. It's the one that's like really gold looking. Oh, let me zoom out so you can actually see it. Um, you guys will laugh at my setup. It is the, <laughs> I have a stand, um, a microphone stand, and uh, for singing and playing the piano at the same time. Um, and I have my Switch. I don't know if you guys ever played the game. It's called, um, oh shoot, I forget what it's called, but it's an exercise game. And you put this like strap around your leg um, when you do the exercises, and that's the strap I'm using. I literally have my phone strapped in a very precar precarious way, so it might fall. We'll just have to see. Anyway, K, uh, so it's, anyway, it's high up, so it's kind of hard to see where everything is, so I'm sorry if it's like making no sense to you. So K444, I believe, if it's not iridescent, it's the other kind, I forget what it's called, but it's like this very like gold color, like it just looks like gold. And then um, four very best diamonds which so far are my favorite I haven't tried this kind yet um, but the very dust I've had in my fearless familiar kit which I'm almost done with I'll do a post review um, probably when I do the post review I will also do a face reveal um, just because I think that's kind of fun it's fun to see the face behind uh, the person who's talking you know it's always nice to put a face to the person who's talking so ooh, those are just gorgeous it looks like like a teal one a purple um, almost like a yellow and gold. These are two are very similar. I'd be interested to see what those look like, how they're different from each other. Okay, so yeah, um, excited to put that in the logbook. Uh, yeah, look at all those extra stickers. I'm totally gonna just use those for those cheaper kits that I have so I can kit those up easily because they're already ready stickers that are perfect sizes. Um, wow, look at that, look at those colors. Okay, are you ready? Um, going to make sure to, so I don't knock you over, but look at this, it just kind of, look, that is huge. I'm just going to try not to look at it while I am rolling this the opposite way. Since this is poured glue, um, you wouldn't want to do this double-sided uh, adhesive. But since this is poor glue, you can roll it the opposite way and it'll be just fine. And Diamond Art Club does have the uh, self straightening canvases. Oh my gosh, guys, I don't know if this is going to. Ooh, there you go. I'm going to lose that. I don't know if this whole kit is going to fit in. Ooh, just barely. Barely. You're going to have to look at it sideways a little bit. Okay, are you ready? Set. <gasps> no. Oh. My gosh, I would just hang this up as is. It's so beautiful and it's own. Look at that. Here, I'm going to actually turn it so it's the right side. But it's just we're gonna have to like move it up and down a bit. Let's see. Just like from the bottom to the top, I'll just take you there. And then maybe in a little bit. Oh, it's gonna be hard to like zoom in. Get it a little closer. Just incredible. Wow. Yeah, one of these days I'll get a setup where you can actually see. You can straighten it out a little bit more by just pulling back the plastic and pulling it back out. It's harder with the larger canvases for sure to do that. But it will help. Straighten things out a bit. 
I'm not gonna do that right now though because I'm messing it up. No. Okay. Yeah. I will get that set up in just two minutes. It's huge. I did not realize how big this was. Uh, I'm gonna love every second of it though. Absolutely love every second of it. Okay. Let me turn this back over and we'll take a look at the drills. Oh, so pretty. And this canvas, like. I forgot to put out the stuff about the canvas. So it is um, incredibly soft, love it. I've tried quite a few now um, of how these feel and I just have not found something that is quite so soft. It is so soft. Um, and it has the scalped edges, which I just think it gives it such a good finish, like look to it. I don't, I don't even think I would buy anything expensive no matter what it felt like if it didn't have the scalped edges. It just makes such a difference in appearance. It also has the, um, the poke holes in it. I forget what that's called. Um, it's on the tip of my tongue. Anyway, it has the poke holes in it, um, and that helps to like prevent fraying and stuff. So, I'll that out. Wow. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh my gosh, hair everywhere. I have like really long hair and it gets everywhere. It drives my husband crazy. He says I should cut it, and I just don't have the heart to. It's also kind of just easier to have it long than this. All right, I'm gonna pause you guys so you don't want to listen to. Look at that. Look at those colors. I know some people love it, some people hate that sound of the plastic, so one moment. There we are, look at that. Uh-oh, did it just zoom in? I don't want it zoomed in yet. Look at that, oh, beautiful. Here, I'm gonna move over to the other side because it's easier to everybody see what's going on in the camera. Look at those colors. I am so in love. This might be my favorite canvas. No, I'm not even my, it is my favorite canvas. Ooh, I really like, I can't decide a favorite. I have mermaid bedroom and I'm that color palette as soon as I took the drills out to look at that. Oh, chef's kiss. I can't remember which YouTube says YouTuber says chef's kiss, but it stuck with me. I love it. Um, I love that saying. Okay, so let's look at these. Um, I don't know, is there even 310 in this one? There might not even be 310. I think there is, but um, let's do this. Let's see. Okay, let's just start with the one that has this least amount first. Whoa! Here's actually one of the ABs right off the bat. Let's see. It's a 111. Wow, that's like almost like a fuchsia pink color. Look at that. I'm sorry, the lighting in here is not amazing. It is really dark in here. Um, one of these days I will get something from it. Oh, we got actually like a one that's not supposed to be in there. Okay, so 3801. 351. Oh, I forgot to say, for those of you who might be new, um, ABs are like, it's short for Aurora, Boreal Aurora Borealis, and it has this iridescent coating to it, which is absolutely gorgeous. It kind of just reflects the light off of what's around it. Um, yeah, it really does have that northern lights coloration to it. That is a gorgeous, almost watermelon red. So 351. 606. I don't know, is that like in her face? That's probably in her face. Like in her makeup. Let me get you back. There, there we go. Um, 3821. 352. Love that pink. Oh my god. I think I love every color in here. 3746. Uh, 817. Another gorgeous red. Uh, 385. Almost like a brownish purple. Really dark berry color. 3688. 406, 3802, ooh, another berry, dark berry color. Oh, I love that one. 523, I love anything mint green. Anything that's like a green, I love, I love all greens. <laughs> I love all greens. 826, that blue, blues as well. 469, so many beautiful greens. 3371, 3837, ooh, look at that one, 700. Almost like a Christmas tree. 422, 729. All right, let's look at this. Okay, this is a short strand right here. Uh, two bags of 746 and two bags of 715. That's probably quite a bit of the background, and this is probably up close to where her face is lit up. Look how many what colors there are. Oh, so gorgeous. Okay, look at that. 912, 3348, 720, 
909. Ooh, here's our first fairy dust. Okay, let's see if we can get that in there. Can you see the way that shimmers? It's very, it's like so subtle, but so beautiful. And it just, it's, I think it's my favorite. I love ABs, but they're harder to place. And they're just like, woo, you know, which I love. They're, I love this. It's, I love it all. Good diamond painting. I love it all. When I say if I don't like something as much as something else, I still love it so much. I just love some things even better than others. And I think the fairy dust is the one I like the most for sure. Um, that's like a, it's almost like a, a muted yellow, like daisy yellow. How would you explain this? Butter yellow. It's gorgeous. Um, here's 782, 309. Ooh, these are pretty like terracotta. Seven, or uh, three, seven, seventy-six. <gasps> no, look at that color. Ah, oh, three sixty-nine. Oh my gosh, that is a beauty. Oh, and look how good that looks. That's the purple. Three thirty-three. It's just this whole thing. Three fifty-six. Eight twenty-three. Four thirty-seven. One fifty-two. Oh, another fairy dust. <gasps> look at that purple. Z554. What is that going to be? That's going to be like probably in the swirls of her hair and her sleeves and a little bit on her bow. I'll find out. Um, 6014, 828. Okay, that's an interesting one. It almost is like kind of see through. It's almost like a, a oh, you know what it reminds me of is like a sea glass like a sea glass green oh that might be my new favorite color out of any color i've ever looked at wild that is so gorgeous oh my gosh i'm so excited for that one okay 825 i'm like a save it to the last kind of person so i'll find which square has like all of those on it or the most of it on there and i will um <laughs> i'll save that to do the last on the whole diamond painting so 976, 989, 3836. Ooh, here's that K444. So you can see like the bright yellow is like the backing, but then you can see right here that that's like the gold. It is so gold. This is the first time I've seen it, seen it in person. Ah, <gasps> that's beautiful. I wonder what that is. Maybe in the stars that's in her hands. Wow, there's quite a bit of it, actually. There's quite a bit more than I thought. Probably in the moon and the stars up there in the corner. <gasps> Maybe I'll end up with a lot of extra in that. Oh my gosh, I would use that so many times. Oh my gosh, look at this green. 367, 701. It's almost like a, mm, I don't know, pine tree green. 3760, ooh, more pine tree greens. 890, 702. Oh, look at that. Teal, 3814, 3810, 3818. Ooh, I just, I can't get enough of these colors. Ooh, there's two packs of this. 958, 518, 593. I'm just getting tired. 993, two packs of that. Oh, I love that color too. Look at that. Incredible. Okay. 598 and 738. I like that color. Okay. Ooh, I was hoping I'd get one of these ABs. Okay, I looked ahead. So 336. I love that color. I've had it. There's a lot of that in Fear of the Summer. It's beautiful. Oh, I was hoping I'd get this. So this is another AB, the second AB, the last AB. It looks white on camera. It is more like a very light sky, minty sky blue. And oh, that might compete for my favorite. I like this and that other like sea glass. Um, fairy dust. Wow, that's gorgeous. Hopefully you can get some of that in there. Okay, and then 310, only one bag of 310. That's wild because Fearless Familiar had like six bags. <laughs> Maybe not that much. Okay, our last fairy dust. Oh, is it our last one? Yeah, I think it's our last fairy dust. Our last special even. And it is like um, a cream, like a darker cream, warm cream color. 
um, Z3855. I don't know if you can see that. It's a little bit harder to see this one. Maybe because my finger's in the way, that probably would help if I moved it. Beautiful. 803. Two bags of 803. Guys, I'm kidding this up. I'll get this up on, on video and fast motion it. And uh, yeah, I'm doing this. I'm doing this. I kind of want to save it. Uh, but I kind of don't. I kind of want to just do it now and love every second. Three bags of this incredible mint green. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, 739. Three bags of this, 739. I can see that. That's probably a lot on her face. This might be her skin color. Um, 991, 3842, and the last is. 939, which is that navy blue color. It looks kind of black on there. Okay, hopefully that'll stay focused. Let's, um, I'm going to move this out of the way and get out those specials and show you what it is. All right, here we are. Wow, gorgeous. Okay, I'm actually probably gonna turn her this way. I was gonna show you guys, I'm a little bit worried. I don't know if it'll catch on camera. I'm a little bit worried about, um, I don't know if I can show you guys or not. And a little bit. Okay, so if you pull back the plastic right here, I don't know if you can see that. It looks like there's like some rivers in the glue. Um, where the glue, uh, here, here we go. I'm just too You can kind of see where the glue looks like it's thinner in those spots. Um, it doesn't feel as quite as sticky either. So I might contact them in our club and see what they say about that. Maybe they'll say it's like not a big deal, which if they do, I trust that they're being honest about that. Um, and I don't know what a big deal. Oh my gosh, now that she's back over again. You are beautiful, girl. Look at you. Oh my gosh, okay, I can already see where some of the... I meant to look ahead of time, but I, I didn't. Um, about where some of these drills are. So let's start with, because uh, I think I have an idea. Oh, let's start with, yeah, 111. This one's right here. Come on, focus. There we go. This very beautiful fuchsia um, AB drill. And I can already tell, like, just like I was thinking. So it's right here in her, pull my sleeve back a bit. Uh, right here in her eyes, right here. We've got some here and here. I think that might be the only spot. Oh, so we actually end up with quite a few extra because that's only a few places. That's gonna that's gonna make her eyes really stand out. So that would be really pretty. Right there in her eyes. Um, let's do the next baby. Oh, it's beautiful mint green. Well, let's see, that's 125. And it's the number two. So let's see where that is. There's gonna be some down here at the bottom. Actually quite a bit down here at the bottom. Um, as you can see, like along blue. This is like the most wrinkled canvas action, actually that I've received from Diamond Art Club. Um, I do have quite a few Diamond Art Club canvases even if I haven't finished a ton yet. Oh, focus, there we go. So I'm, I might I might talk to them about that. It's very wrinkled um, in a way that like the back is actually looks like those won't come out. So I'd love to see. Um, anyway, so yeah, there's some twos right there and like the kind of waves down at the bottom. Um, there's quite a few twos over, hopefully you can see them over here. Over here, kind of the, I, oh, it's her hair. It's her hair, oh, gorgeous. So twos along here, um, some at the top there, just kind of dotting interspersed here. Uh, I think it looks like it, it might be some of the stars in the sky back there. Um, some along here, so all along kind of just the edging. Um, I don't see a lot on her, but I think it's her hair and kind of the stars at the top. So that's just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful that one. Let me zoom in again and let's see that one. So it does look white on camera. It's it's a, just a really light blue. All right, so let's get started on the fairy dust diamonds. So I'll start with this kind of like buttercream yellow baby zoom. Okay, so the Z3822, and that is going to be the like cancel symbol. And there's some in her hands right here. Um, on both her hands, some fairy dust, like her hands are glowing. Oh, that's gonna be beautiful. Um, let's see. There's not a lot of this, so I imagine it won't be everywhere. 
mostly in her hands. I don't really see it anywhere else. Oh, no, that's a lie. There's some up here in her hair. Right here, kind of showing off. Like, it almost was like where her face is glowing and like anything that glows, whatever the reflection is of the glowing. Wow, that rendering is amazing. Good job, Diamond Art Club. Those are great places to put this one. So, okay, so that's the yellow one. And this is kind of like a, um, maybe I should put them next to each other so you can see the difference. Like, one is very buttery yellow and one is kind of like a cream beigey almost has like a pink tone to it um very beautiful so that's z3855 and that's going to be kind of a slash symbol and so that's also in her hair oh they're going to be kind of similarly next to each other they're both going to be having the same function of um Kind of showing off the glow that is coming from her skin or from the stars in her hands um, right here oh there's tons of them right here and right here just kind of showing off the glow in her sleeves right here all around these stars right there um yeah mostly there's some in the corners here oh wait no no, no. yes yes yeah here um beautiful yeah wait let's do um this purple fairy dust color. It's a little bit harder to see the fairy dust on this one. But it's very subtle. It's very beautiful. There you go. It's uh, Z55 or 554. That is the symbol. It's like a tent symbol. <laughs> it's like a tent. Um, there's some over here in her sleeves. Oh, some of these you can't see. I'm sorry. Um, so like there's quite a bit in her sleeve. It's, it's like the purple in her sleeve. Um, there's purple... Um, from a lot of the other purples, there's a lot of the purples, and then it's just kind of emphasizing the purple in her hair. There's a lot right here. There's some right up here at the top um, by that moon. Um, yeah, that's just kind of emphasizing the purple in her uh, little bow tie right here. Ribbon, I guess, is what it would be. There's so many colors in her eyes. I'm really excited for that. Okay, ooh, yay. I'm so excited for this one. Z. Um, 368, so that's the fairy dust. It's like the sea gloss green. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, um, that is a T. So that is going to be, there's some right here, kind of in her shirt along here. Um, under her, let's see, that's another right there. Then here at the bottom, this is a lot more just kind of interspersed everywhere. Some here. Um, see some up here. Here, up here. Tease. Yeah, not a lot. I look up there emphasizing kind of her face and stuff. A lot of the specials are going to be in her face. No more. Oh, some right here. They're just kind of everywhere. They're just kind of emphasizing the greens. So pretty. Oh, that's gonna be so pretty. Okay, last one, but certainly not least. Wow. Sorry, I was looking at it up close to myself first. Before I show you that, um, I don't think it's iridescent. I think iridescent is, but I think it's the other kind. Um, I forget what it's called, I should know. Maybe I'll put it up, I'll write it if I learn how. I don't know how to edit yet. I'm gonna start looking that up and do a better job about editing and stuff. So anyway, so let's, I'm, I, I, I can already guess where that is. Yeah, L's, that's in these stars right here. There's some sparkled, sprinkled under her hair. Oh, sorry for the glare. There's some sprinkled under her hair, around her face, um, some in her eyes. Uh, let's see, but the moon up there, you see that? And the star up there. Right here, this one that's on her shoulder, and the star here on her shoulder as well. Gorgeous. And they're kind of just little spritz of it down here at the bottom. You can see that okay. You just you can see down at the bottom. It's kind of everywhere. It's just gonna kind of give that's gonna be beautiful. Wow. I now that I'm seeing this, Margaret Miles, I mean I love Margaret Miles new, but now I'm seeing this. I want the dragon one too. Um the fox face one. I should know the names of these. I don't. Um, that one's not really my thing. Um, 
especially uh, my kids are like very hyper aware when people are showing a lot of skin. Like, not that I like the worst ones, it's all the time in the summer, but um, especially with the artwork, you know, if they're like, oh, she's showing a lot of skin, mom. <laughs> so just kind of for their sake, um, I probably won't get the other one. It's beautiful. Reds really are not my thing, although I'll choose like a really good red. But even the colors in that one are just like not my thing, even though it's still beautiful. I will probably, I saw that it came back in stock today, the dragon one, um, and I almost got it. But even while I was thinking about it, it was gone. It was so fast. So if you guys see it, want it, if any of these come back in stock, pick it up right away because it's going to be gone so fast. Um, my unicorns, the, which I'm sure is for a lot of people, um, under the stairs and flower delivery too. Each time I've sat on that one too long thinking about it and it's gone and I will not make that mistake again. If it comes out, I will buy it straight away, right away. So um, yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous. Uh, thanks for doing this with me, guys. I, you'll see a, a kidding up here pretty soon for this one and um, yeah, I'll work on this one with me. Gorgeous, so beautiful. Anyway, like and subscribe. I'd love to have you guys follow me on my channel, hit that notification so you can see when I kit this up and um, work on this one with you guys. And anyway, yeah, let's, uh, I'm so excited to start this YouTube journey and hope everything goes well. I, I love diamond painting. It's um, It's been my new obsession in a way that there's not been another hobby that's done this for me. So incredible. So anyway, yeah. I will see you guys soon. Bye.